Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. Thank you for showing up, thank you for watching. Today I'm very excited to bring Cyberpunk to the entry level M1 MacBook Air. As you guys can see, I'm running the game right now at a resolution of 1024 by 768. And you know, I just wanna point out that don't be fooled by the performance that you're seeing here at the beginning. This is actually not gonna be how the game is gonna run or perform, you know, further out into the game. Now I tested the game for around 35 minutes. The first five minutes were pretty good, pretty decent, but that's probably due to the fact that the system yet hasn't throttled and hasn't heated up a lot. And second, since you know, you here you're in a small closed area, you know, in the uh, corporate offices, but once you hit out the outside world, you hit the streets, that's when everything else has to be loaded, and that's when the system is going to throttle a lot. So, you know, what do we get in the end? Well, we get a game that's running anywhere between 5 to 10 or 5 to 12 frames per second. It lags a lot. It slows down a lot. There are other areas that take forever to load, but hey, the game doesn't crash. And you know, at least in my opinion, I find it amazing that this entry level laptop, fanless laptop from already, you know, three years ago, this is from 2020, is running this game. You know, it's it's running this game and it's it's just amazing. I believe it's a breakthrough. I believe it it, it proves a lot. You know, today we're already looking at the M2 Ultra, which probably would be able to run this game Listen, just sorry, like a champ. Yeah, yeah, but, you know, right you know, just, you know, taking a look at uh, the sure, fact sure. that this, you know, power efficient SOC is running Cyberpunk through layers of software and translation. Well, the porting kit and whatnot, but that that's the whole thing. And I believe it's it's very amazing. So is the game uh, playable? Well, no, of course, it's not playable. But uh, this goes to prove that, hey, you know, the M chips are still very powerful. The game is running. It doesn't crash. You know, it's just it just it's just lacking resources. It needs more RAM. It needs more GPU cores. And it obviously needs to be properly cooled. So probably if you were to have the M1 uh, MacBook Pro or even I should test it on my M1 Mac mini with uh, 16 gigabytes of RAM, we would probably see, you know, slightly better performance. Not sure if we would be able to get a, you know, better frame rate you know, to the point where the game would actually be playable. But, you know, for sure, you know, double the RAM, we would profit from that both, you know, uh, visually and, uh, and system wise. And also active cooling would uh, allow the cores to sustain their higher frame rate. So anyways, as I, as I said at the beginning, any system uh, after this one should be able to handle, uh, you know, the game much better. And in the end, you know, what, uh, you know, what, what, what's most important out of this is the fact that this system is running this game. And that means that, you know, with uh, this opens a, a, a whole new world, let's put it that way. It, it opens up uh, a lot of uh, possibilities now for uh, us to uh, play Windows games on the Mac environment. So, guys, I'm looking forward as well to lots of testing with this game kit. And uh, hopefully we'll be able to see, um, you know, other games that maybe... Uh, you know, maybe once before we thought uh, we weren't going to be able to play, but hey, look at us now. We got Cyberpunk running on the M series, uh, MacBooks and Macs. So uh, thank you guys for watching this. As I said earlier, this is just the beginning of the game. Um, I suggest you just uh, forward. Uh, well, actually, you guys, you can follow the chapters. But anyways, um, you'll see that the performance uh, further ahead isn't actually what we're seeing here. So, guys, thank you once again and enjoy the rest of the video. Effective. What would you do in my position? You have to defend yourself. Remind Abernathy you're not her doormat. You're right. Smack her once, but hard. She'll respect you. Seems we see eye to eye on this issue. Take this. It's what I've collected over the past weeks. Biometrics, trauma team card, names of her closest associates, driver. 
Chief of security. Lover. Lover's husband. Everything. Use it, and make sure Abernathy won't be a problem anymore. You said it. I need to defend myself. If anyone finds out we even talked about this, I'll go down with you. That's true. But everyone knows you only made it to where you are thanks to me. So it's not like they could ever believe you played no part in it. What'll happen if I refuse? Don't ask stupid questions. This isn't a request, V. We seem to understand each other. Take this, too. Use this money only. Find the right people for the job. No corporate affiliation. And for the core task, use someone you know inside out. Are we clear? Yeah, I think we're clear. Good. In that case, I'll await your report. And good luck with it. I have my AV waiting outside. It's yours to use. And don't disappoint me. Jenkins, Night City Counterintelligence. I have those reports you asked for? They were supposed to be ready yesterday. I, I know, but I, I have them now. Send them to my inbox, and you and I will have a word about this later. AB, you alive? I'll stink to the Viper Pit. Viper Pit. Couldn't have said it better. You in some trouble? Not yet. Right now, I just need a soul I can trust. That kind of sounded like a yes. Meet me at Lizzie's. Be there in an hour. stamp on something. It's possible one of our assets was exposed. Is it Frankfurt again? No, different issue. Local. Tell me. Quick version. Our agent at Biotechnica suspects they might be on to him. They recently granted him red security clearance. That's top. He's been fishing for dirt, but it's been slow. Your point? They're clean. Like we run orphanages clean. Bleach server clean. We suspect they flagged him and are feeding him phony data. Should we green light Xfil or let him keep looking? Pull him out, but calmly. Don't raise any eyebrows. Otherwise, they'll catch on. Jenkins will be livid. I'll handle Jenkins. Understood.
the world's going to tear us. Access granted. your destination. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Be think. Won't come. Ch Got the money.
within reach. Hey, you lost? Got a problem? V, is that right? You're from Arasaka HQ. We're here for you. Jenkins assigned you a task today. You'll share all the details with us. No, don't believe I will. That's between me and Jenkins. Ugh, fuck! How you feeling? Pretty sharp dive, huh? Your access to company networks is hereby revoked. In two minutes, any company cybernetics in your possession will cease functioning. Give us the data you received from Jenkins. This will conclude termination procedures. How the hell did you find out? That is not your concern. The data, now. <sighs> Information is on the shard. Smart choice. <sighs> we done. With the formalities? Yes. But I think Abernathy would gladly up our fee for ridding her of a piece of rot like you. Stand up! Come on, move it! Bye, us, Bennett. I think you fellas might have forgotten just how far from home you are. I'm sure this body was your style, let alone a healthy option. Is that a threat? Well, you start shooting, maybe we join in, huh? Before you know it, somebody might die. We have what we came for. Ooh, Doc. V. to say I still have a friend, 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 friend. That's sweet.
some fat ass chunk of cha chain just right for a new start Hey, hermano. Your new life. It starts. in this city of dreams. Ooh, I love this town. Love it like you might love a mother.
to say I, I still <laughs> probably so that's right hey V here my you out on the steps of an orphan we got another day ahead of us in this city of dreams I think we're looking for is somewhere in this building. Probably crawling with the pendejos that kidnapped her. Eyes and ears open, all right? Speaking of which, got you a little something. Militech training shard. In case you need to uh, brush up on your dance moves. Down for some target practice in VR? Not now, Jack. No time. Maybe later. Sure, sure. Mañana. Mañana. Let's do this. Elevator. This way. Targets Sandra Dorset. Targets Biomon went mute a couple hours back. Suspected abduction. Target could have possibly flatlined already. Not sure you're in time. We're in time, Bug. We. Sure you're on phones, but that don't make you any less part of this squad. Squad. Charming. Bug, you could at least try to be nice. You want nice, supportive? Call a damn helpline. Zero eyes on her biomon. On 
Fingers crossed it's not too late. Ugh, I hate this life or death shit. Hurry. Try hacking the door. Think you can trip it on your own, V? Sandra Dorset's protected under Echelon 2 corporal immunity. Our girl's top shelf. V, Mira, eyes up. Pendejos ahead. Drop it quiet, V. I'm reloading! Ah. Jingo! 